breed over at the Fang Center. Peggy's took all the animals, but I think she's...
denied any of this to happen. I was brought here under false pre pretenses and fed lies about Joseph C. and his family. Foolishly, I believe. But now, after the great generosity they have given me,
object in jeopardy. I want this coward to know that they have my attention. My hunters are coming for you. There's nowhere you can run. Hunters. It don't sound too good. If Jacob wants you, he's gonna send his best out after you. Watch your back, deputy. All that gunfire it came from Elliot's house. Let's go check it out. Oh, good. You're here. I'm just glad to see it out of the cult's hands, training those wolves to cause hell. And they've been shipping those crazy wolves all the way to the old lumber mill. Keep an eye on prisoners. Now, we had a bear here named Cheeseburger. Bit of a local celebrity, actually. Had a soft spot for Chad's barbecue. But he got the diabetes, so we put him on a liquid salmon diet. Anywho, Colt tried to take him, so I set him free. Last I heard, he was causing all sorts of mayhem. Someone should go find him, make sure he's all right. Grab some salmon from the pond ahead of time, though. Then feed Cheeseburger that salmon, and he'll be eaten out of the palm of your hand. forgotten what it is to be strong. You know, our heroes used to be gods. And now our heroes are godless, weak, feeble, diseased. We let the weak dictate to the powerful, and then we are shocked to find ourselves adrift. But history knows the value of sacrifice. Of culling the herd so that it stays strong. Over and over, the lives of the many have outweighed the lives of the few. This is how we survived, and we forgot them. And now, the bill has come due. Now, the collapse is upon us. In this time, the lives of the few outweigh the lives of the many. And when a nation that's never known hunger or desperation descends into madness, we'll be ready. We will call the herd. We will do what needs to be done.
Well done. Bothering with this, they're all check them anyways. Why am I all stuck on corpse duty? Mm. Holy oh, shit! Uh, oh what? fuck! Live one. Walk or go to the truck. Yes, sir. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Give me a hand, kid. <laughs> Eli, is this? Yep. What the fuck is the deputy doing here? Jacob took a shine to him, same as us. You're gonna be okay, hero. Whitetail's got you now. Uh, We're bringing him back to the wolf's den? Where else? Tammy's not gonna like this. Don't worry about Tammy, she'll be fine. Are you out of your fucking mind? Now, hold on. Weedy and I agreed. Oh, you agreed. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I was the best and impartial observer. This is stupid. And this is dangerous. You both know better. What was I supposed to do? Leave him to die. Tammy. They've been in that room for God knows how long. I've seen what it does to people. You haven't. You can't trust this one. That's what everyone said about you. But luckily, I didn't listen. This is not up for discussion. We need him. That's all there is to it. Understand? You're right. She took that real well. Out! I didn't do anything. I meant what I said. We need you. Let's get you some rest. Hey, bud. Hey there, deputy. Head down the hall. E Eli's been waiting for you there. Love to talk, but Eli needs a word with you. Not safe to hunt with Jacob the boys running around. There you are. Been trying to track you down, deputy. Dutch speaks highly. Look, I'll get right to it. I know what you did down south. You got the father thinking twice now, and that's good for us. We're bleeding bodies up here. No two ways about it. I don't know if we'll be able to hold out more than a week at this rate. 
Times are desperate, to say the least. I'm trying to get some footholds back, so I sent a handful of whitetails out to sabotage the visitor center. The cult's been using it as a depot for that bliss shit. But our guys walked right into a fucking trap. They've been taken hostage and we're up against the clock. If I just send another group in there, we risk losing everything. But you, you're something that cult ain't expecting. You're the only one I got around here who can handle this, Step. Only one I trust to handle this. I'm counting on you. You'll need to go in quiet. Cult gets windier around, they're liable to kill our people. There's a bow on the table if you need it. Get our people back, Deb. Good luck. It's Corey, by the way. Possible room block near the southern entrance. It's Corey, by the way. You're gonna help us take this mountain back. Might have come across a little harsh earlier. I ain't apologizing. I'm just acknowledging. I don't trust people I don't know. But Eli says you're all right, so I gotta go with that until I see otherwise. You prove your worth, and you and I will get along just fine. Here's the deal. Weedy's trying to get a pirate radio station up and running. He told Eli it's to help coordinate the militia, but I'm pretty sure he just wants to play his own music. So we're gonna indulge him. Problem is, he can't get a signal out. Our friend here said the cult's been jamming this whole area. Also told us how. Seems there's two radio towers with jammers on them and a third on a mobile unit patrolling the roads. Take the towers out first. That ought to clear the signal enough for me to locate the patrol. I'll let you know when I find it. Do this, and maybe we can start building some of that trust up. So, you've met Eli. You're in good hands now. He'll get you squared away with anything they need up there in the mountains. I'll still keep an eye on you, though. Talk soon, kid.